In a show of major military strength, Russia has now announced that it is embarking on a major show of force with the start of a military drill including the Yars Intercontinental Ballistic Missile. More than 3,000 military personnel and over 300 equipments are said to be involved in this latest show of strength. During the exercises, the Yars systems will conduct maneuvers in three Russian regions, the Russian Defense Ministry said, without identifying those regions. This exercise is about checking the missile forces, in which the Novorossi burst missile forces will also be taking part. Russian President Vladimir Putin has aimed to make the Yars missile system, which replaced the Topo system, part of Russia's invincible weapons and the mainstay of the ground-based component of its nuclear arsenal. There are only a few confirmed tactical and technical characteristics of the Yars mobile ICBM, which reportedly have an operational range of 12,000 km and can carry multiple nuclear warheads. It can travel up to 20 mark and can carry multiple independently targetable nuclear warheads and can also be mounted on truck carriers or deployed in silos. Prior to this, in December 2022, Russia had announced that a regiment armed with avant-garde missiles had conducted combat duty in the Orenburg region. The avant-garde hypersonic glide vehicle can fly through the dense layers of the atmosphere at up to 27 Mach, performing direction and altitude maneuvers and overcoming any missile defenses. Since launching its invasion of Ukraine in February last year, Russia has conducted numerous military exercises on its own or with other countries such as China or South Africa. It has also increased military training with Belarus, which borders both the Russia and Ukraine, conducting a series of comprehensive drills over the past year. The battle with Ukraine has now reached day number 399 and no side is clearly close to victory. A few gains have been accrued to both countries but nobody can boast about a clear cut in road. Ukraine on its part has just received first batch of Leopard 2 tanks and Challenger 2 tanks from Germany and UK respectively. With the help of these main battle tanks, Ukraine is hoping to inflict significant damages to Russian troops in the battle. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.